Man, you got some good stuff. Yeah, man. Hey, man, how's it going? Good. You mind if I record, do you? Hey, everyone, what's going on? And welcome back to the channel. So quite recently, I came across an ad online where someone was selling a lot of old toys and retro memorabilia. So anyway, I thought it was right worth now. taking a look and getting some footage here Damn. on the channel. Um, one of the cool things that this guy had that um, oh, unfortunately yeah, he had already sold, he had a lot of Transformer toys I was really oh, interested right in. He actually sold those for $5,000. Oh, and what you're Joe? looking at right Come now is this. a old original G.I. Joe That's airplane. Oh, Pretty cool, okay. I always liked that kind of stuff. Anyway, just thought I wanted to share it with my subscribers uh, as far as some of the travels and other things that I definitely like to do. I still love collecting toys, memorabilia, for stuff, for, for things for the game room. But um, he has a lot of good collectibles. He even has the old Dreamcast uh, for sale. I think he's selling that for either uh, 250 or 400 bucks. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoy the footage. And here he has the original slag uh, from the Transformers or the original one that was before. Transformers became Transformers. That's what he says. But uh, anyway, I so saw quite a few original. things here. Picked up a little bit. Anyway, just hope you guys. So this is the original one before they actually went to. Okay. You wouldn't happen to have any GoBots, would you? No. Nope. Okay. Man, you got everything here, man. Got to find me some more. And you have uh, how much for your Dreamcast this one? Yeah, how much? Four fifty. Four fifty. With five games. So 350, which game does it uh that you have to take out? It's egg. It's an RPG, it's worth 250. Egg, it's worth 250. Dark Millennium, episode two. One year has passed since the battle of the fourth empire. A new level of peace and harmony has spread throughout the world. Ghost Rider, a thousand bucks? Yeah. What's so special about this ghost right here? Let me take a look. These right here? Yeah, it does look pretty dated. Were these made back in the early 90s or the 80s? Early 90s? Yeah. Oh, wow. So each one of these. You can tell by the film, it's like yellowish. Oh, you're selling all of them for a thousand. Oh, okay. I thought you were selling just the one. Oh, it's a full set. There you go. One, two, three, four. Okay. That's Ghost Rider is just a freebie. <laughs> you can buy Ghost Rider alone if you want to. Hey, man, you're a serious collector, man. You got some pretty rare stuff here. Usually for high end stuff like that, you can do multi payments or you can trade in stuff and I can devalue it. Okay, they sell it like half the price. Okay. But you need to trade in stuff. Right, right. Yeah. Undertaker here. This is we got four of these. How much for the wrestlers? Seven hundred for these four guys. Oh my god! We can god. do um. I think we can do five. Can do five. five of these. Yeah. Okay. Oh, the warrior. The price went up to four hundred. <laughs> When Undertaker retired, the price went up to 300. Oh man, I figured that. 
Yeah, I never really was a big time wrestler collector growing up. I don't know, their, their toys weren't as cool as uh, like Ninja Turtles and He-Man and everything else. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Alright, well, I gotta grab me something here. Uh, Did I ask you for the marble? Yeah, I was looking for... Uh, and then the lino is behind me. Okay. The funny thing is, I have this Captain America. I, I have the Captain America car, too. <laughs> you remember, do you have the uh, the old Spider-Man car? No, no. Because no. there was a Spider-Man car made at the same time as Captain America. And I got that one back in, like, 2002 or... Two old old Spider-Man is right here. No, no, but do you have the uh, the car? No. Oh, you don't have that? Okay. Yeah, because I have the Captain America car. I can't, there was one that was made back in the late 80s. Um, let me put this aside. I always wanted to find it and I couldn't, so. I was like the first animated one. Uh, first animated one of what? Really, where? <laughs> you mean the one from the old 1970s commercial? No, the, uh, the, the, cartoon? the one, the hit cartoons one in the 90s. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. You know what? I got the same one with uh with the um with the parachute. Oh, I had that too. <laughs> you had that one too? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I got that one sticking up on my wall. Let's see here. This is Star Wars. Something. Uh, do you have any original Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles? No. Okay. Can you go heart? Man, I really wish you had that jet fire in the box. This is this character down here. Oh, we got a Robin here. Let's see, is there a price on this one? Is this a set? Is there a price on you, Robin? Yeah. Yes. Oh, 35. Oh, 35, okay. from the anime Jinro. 
It's a Nazi anime. Never heard of it. Let me mm -hmm. see it. Let me see it. <laughs> so it's a Japanese anime? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, yeah, the gas mask thing, like the Germans before. Okay. So it lights up, you know. <laughs> His eyes turns to red. Oh, cool. <laughs> Old anime. <laughs> you have all the best stuff tucked away somewhere. <laughs> okay, let me see here. What is. All right, well, let me just start off with the line of the day. I can come back, right? All right. And how much for Darth Vader? Oh, 270. Yeah, I always wanted one of those G.I. Joe's when I was a kid. Pretty cool. Yeah, G.I. Joe had some interesting toys back in the 80s. See if we got any rare games over here. Uh, looks like N64, Nintendo. Are you looking for anything specific? No, just kind of browsing around, seeing what you had. So, did you used to run the stores and just move everything to your garage? No. Just two years ago. Uh huh. About right before the pandemic, huh? Yeah. And I just wanted to get rid of my stuff. I'm, I'm downsizing. Right. The problem is, um, when it started, too many, too many people um, bought my stuff. They wanted more, so I had to restock. Oh. But it's, it's, it's becoming so expensive to restock. So what I did is, um, I asked other sellers to bring their stuff here. The, the, the people in the, in the fan page. Right. So most of their stuff, like the, the, the Star Wars, the Turtles, the Plums, the Shoes, Power Rangers, X-Men, they're from other sellers. Man, so I really wanted to those. Yes, help them sell their stuff because they lost their shops to the pandemic. Wow. The only stuff I have here is the video game and the anime. Oh, I see. <laughs> Yeah, I really wanted those transformers, man. Five grand. Five grand? Who bought those? Another collector? Yep. Alright, I'll just start off with the line up for today. Oh, how much for your uh, Nintendo Wii? Oh, not too bad. It's too expensive. I can do two. Yeah, because I know the system itself goes for 50. Then you have a controller. We can sell stand alone. They sell like 75. Oh, okay. All right, we'll just take the line out today. Sweet. Yeah, I still got my N64. And a few games for that. 
Yeah, good collection. You sell on the TV too? Yeah. <laughs> oh, so how much for the CRT? This one, that's 250. Mm -hmm. This one is 200 behind you. The Sony one. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is the higher end. Right. And then there's, a, there's another one that's 150 there behind the chair in the back. And are you selling? Oh, you're selling these, obviously. Yeah. Oh, what's this up here? Oh, that's, that's real tempting. Yeah, when I finish working on my game room, I gotta add some more posters and stuff. <laughs> and how much is the Michael Jordan life size? It's not for sure yet. Uh, for now. Like two grand. I'll give you half a million dollars for it. <laughs> <laughs> You can offer, but it's not for sale now. Okay. Because we collect our Jordan products. Okay. Cool. Yeah, I know a bunch of guys that may want to stop by and grab some stuff. That's all they do is collect retro games and everything else. <laughs> 